Hello and welcome to another MMU Q-Step video on theoretical frameworks. In this video, we'll be looking at what theoretical frameworks are, why we need them and why they're so important. A theoretical framework describes and explains an existing research problem and effectively helps frame your research. Using a sociological example, you could be researching why children from a working class background are less likely to perform well in academia in comparison to children from middle class families. Here you could draw upon Bordeaux's work on social capital and how the classroom reflects middle class values, resulting in children from middle class families being more likely to engage in education. What we would have done here is identify the research problem and back up our findings with theory using a theoretical framework. It's important to remember that you should always back up your research with theories and academic literature in order to avoid plagiarism and give credit to the original authors. In addition, you may be wondering where you should get your references from, so I will list a few to guide you. It's important to reference and cite academic references such as SAGE, the MMU Library and Google Scholar in comparison to non-academic references such as Wikipedia, online news sites and magazines as your research will lack credibility and academic status. Thank you for watching this Q-Step video on how to use a theoretical framework in research. I hope you leave understanding what a theoretical framework is and how to use them. Created using Powtoon.